place, Carl Vinson and With the commissioning of the aircraft carrier Carl Vinson in March, the Navy had another nuclear-powered flat top to work into the fleet. Its final decision will mean some big changes for thousands of sailors. The Vinson will be heading to the West Coast to be homeported in Alameda, California. In return, Norfolk will get the carrier Coral Sea, a World War II vintage vessel. The idea is to give the West Coast another nuclear-powered carrier, creating a balance, two in the Pacific and two in the Atlantic. The actual switch will take place next summer during a round-the-world cruise. It means 3,000 Tidewater families will be moving west. The government will pick up the tab, but only for sailors who commit themselves to spending at least a year on Vinson after the cruise next summer. But there's another change in the works as well. Norfolk will be losing the nuclear-guided missile cruiser Texas to San Diego and won't get another ship to take her place. The thinking is that the Texas move will provide a Navy-wide balance of cruisers with nuclear carriers. The effect of this two-for-one swap will be felt not only by the people doing the moving, but by the area they leave behind as well, because it means the effective loss of more than 1,100 sailors who've been pumping $6.3 million a year into Tidewater's economy. Kathy Midkiff, The Daily News.